Tommy, great to see you again. Thank you for joining us today. This is a crazy world that you're in here, and uh, obviously you did what you did back in February with the big win over Jake Paul. And a lot of people have been saying that, man, KSI, that guy is confident. When he speaks about you and the way in which he talks about how this fight is going to go down, some are calling him delusional, some are calling him overconfident, some think he's going to pull it off. When you hear him talk about you and the fight, the way in which he does, what goes through your mind? We all know what's going to happen. I mean, if anybody doesn't know what's going to happen, they need a new brain. There's no way this man can live with me. Yeah, I'm in a crossover world of boxing. It is what it is. It's a circus act. We've seen that all week. You know, we know what we're in for. I'm here to fight. You know, cut all the other bullshit. Get the biggest knife you can find in the draw and cut the bullshit. We're fighting in two days. Oh, this fight's been sold. Everything's done. The talking's done. My fists are going to do the talking on Saturday. And I promise you now it's going to be an early night. Because I'm going to do to KSI what should have been done to Jake Paul. Does it have to be an early night for you? 100%. I'm coming out here to make a statement. I'm not coming to jib and jab around like he did with Paul. Fight up and down. I'm not interested in doing that. I'm coming here to make a statement. And this will be over inside three rounds. Typically, his fights don't last very long. From what you've seen of him, what impresses you most about his boxing? Well, who's he fought? He's fought a rapper and the rest of the YouTubers. I mean, what is going on? Like, I think everyone's getting it twisted here. Just because the man's very, very big on social media and this and that, it's a fucking bum. In this boxing world, he is a bum. I'd value KSI more than the dust on the bottom of my trailer. I'm not interested. So, at the end of the day, for me, it's, I'm levels above these guys. Come on. Is he a better boxer than me? No. Is he faster? No. Can he add? No. Is he, has he got, I've got every single advantage. Bigger, stronger, reach, weight, whatever you want. This is going to be an early night, and I promise you, I've watched the Jake Paul fight back. Made a lot of mistakes there. Those same mistakes will not, will not be done again. And I, I'm looking you in the eye now, yeah? This is going to be an early night. All right. Well, on that note, let us say hello to the face of Misfits Boxing. He has taken the world of social media, of music, and crossover boxing by storm. He is the man that Tommy Fury was just talking about. He is the one and only, the inimitable, the often imitated, never duplicated KSI. Those were some strong words from Tommy. Your response? Well, first of all, it's great to see that Tommy doesn't have his dad holding his dick this time. <laughs> but yeah, uh, Tommy Fury. The... Oh, shut the fuck up, John. Okay, that's why you're back there, and I'm over here. All right, so... Tommy Fury, okay, you're the man that, you know, everyone fears, everyone thinks is going to destroy me. I've been looking at some of your sparring partners, okay, uh, Owen Kirk, Owen Kirk, middleweight, pretty ass, I can't lie, pillow hands. I think that's your dad. Oh my god, your dad microphone. is embarrassing. I'm so glad my dad isn't him. Jesus Christ. Uh-huh. Yeah, well, I'm, I'm trying to imitate Mike Wazowski. Obviously, because, you know, Tommy, you look like that. Bro, uh, do you want to put the mask on? Huh? Somebody stop me. <laughs> Dickhead. Oh, shut up. Hey, I... St okay, cool. Can we put a muzzle on his fucking face? Uh, Alright, well, uh, come try it. Come try it, then. Come try it. Come. Come try it. Anyway. Owen Kirk. Owen Kirk, middleweight. Ass. Uh, <laughs> Tommy, could I ask you, while this is all going on, are you okay with your dad getting involved here? Because dad, dad, keep you going. Keep you going, Dad. Come on, bit more. Okay, well, there's... A bit more, come on. There's the answer to that question. But I was actually really curious to hear what you were going to say. Yeah, it, So well, please, if you could continue. All right. What about John, James? just a minute. One more second. Let's just hear what he has to say, and then we'll get back to you in a moment. I'll bring the microphone to you. No problem. Me? What did I do to you? What? I, 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 we're friends, John. Uh, all right. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, Please continue. I wanted to hear what you had to say about his sparring partners. I don't think we're going to be able to because this fucking loudmouth twat is going to keep going. Well, you have a microphone, he doesn't, so you can go over him. All right, James Albert. James Albert. Do you know who that is? Yeah, 
partner. Your sparring partner. And I don't want your sparring partners. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, yeah. I can't hear you. I'm not going to hear you. 38. It's gonna lick the sweat out of my boots. Okay, keep going, keep going, keep going. Are you, are, you, are you trying to come out? Tommy. Why are you trying to hit on me? Who thinks we should get my dad to see here? Come on. Nah, nah, Guys, nah, get me down nah, the show. Nah, come nah. on. Come on. There's a reason. Come on. Why. Jesus Christ. Oh. More bottles being Who's throwing thrown? shit now. Come on. Who's throwing shit? Come on then. Is that fucking Dylan? Why the fuck is he here? Why is everybody looking at me? Why is everybody looking at me? I ain't done a thing. I ain't done no thing. Now, yet anyway. I haven't thrown no bottles. Don't look at me. All right. Hey, who's got the bollocks to throw in the bottle? Come here, Dennis. Come here, Dylan. JJ, can I ask you a question? When you hear Tommy speaking of your skills like that, when you hear how he feels about your confidence, what do you think? Do you think he's looking past you? Do you think he's not respecting you enough? Of course he's looking past me. Of course he's disrespecting me. But, you know, when I get in that ring and show him that I'm different, then you're fucked. You've got to understand, there's no one that fights like me. There's no one that fights like the fighters that fight at shoot fights. And you might have tried to get people to imitate it, but it doesn't matter, bro. It doesn't fucking matter. Look at me when I'm fucking talking to you. Fuck you, you prick. How's that? Illuminous screen. Shut the fuck, fuck up. Fuck you. You are not You should ready be stuck on a traffic light somewhere, mate. Huh? Like, <laughs> you fucking idiot. Yeah, deal with Shut it. Shut the fuck I'm up. I'm ready to go, Listen, bitch. Listen, at the end of the day, your manager knows what's uh -huh. going to happen. You know what's going to happen. Well, Find I'm the biggest you knife out. in the fucking draw and cut the bullshit. I'm going to fuck you Jake up, yeah. Jake Paul said he was fucking different. Jake Paul, is Jake Paul got beat. on my level. He got beat. Not on your Jake level. Paul on my level. Can I say one thing to you? Jake Paul knocked you down. I hope, I hope, yeah. Jake Paul knocked you down. I hope that he comes out swinging. I hope that. I pray for that. Because when, when you do that, I swear to God, it'll be an even quicker I night know I what you're you. trying to do. You're trying to time that uppercut. I'm trying to time you're uppercut. You're trying to time that I don't uppercut. need to time nothing with you. Let's see you if you can do my overhand. Day, let's see if my overhand hey, reaches let's your see, fucking let's face see, first. Let's see if you're allowed to do what you've done in your previous fights. Just let's see. Let's see. My overhand will be Your overhand, I'll let you hit me. And fucking knock you out. You, you, I'd let you, you hit bro, me. The amount of times Jake Paul hit you with an overhand, you're a bum. I'm about to do the you fucking are a same. You're a bum. You look tiny, bro. This is you got skinny <laughs> ass legs. You know when you say I look tiny, you skinny do not mean a lot legs. Big. Take your jacket Lollipop off. You. Take ass. your jacket off. Take your jacket Lollipop off. Lollipop looking Take your jacket ass. Off. Take your jacket off. Uh, he Take said he's finishing off. you very quickly. What's your official prediction for how the fight plays out on Saturday? I'm going to knock oh, you I feel like he keeps changing. Say something different. One minute. One minute he's there like round one. He's not going to make it out. Another interview. Round two, he's not making it out. Another interview. Round three, he's not making it out. What round is it, buddy? Well, I'm telling you. What round is you it? You will crawl out of this ring. You will be Which round? I'm out intrigued. Of this ring. You keep changing. Let me tell you now. As yeah? we get closer to the fight, right, you keep okay. Take your glasses pushing off, the round. I'm looking your eye when I say it to Let's, you. Perfect. Hi. How are we doing? You. Hey, I'm not smiling. I, I can smile all I want. I'm you excited. Will not, look. Okay. Look at me now. For one I'm second. looking at you. You will not make it out of round three. Oh, it's round three. Round okay, three. Cool. And Noted. I promise you that. Oh, and guess what? If he uh -huh. comes in swinging like a man uh -huh. who's drunk out the pub, it'll be over in round one. Uh, you won't be able to deal with it. Have you seen my pace? I won't be able I'm to deal with it. Fast. Trust I me. Take it hey, away, my man, friend. You know, hold on, hold on. I okay. heard that he said that I've underestimated him and yeah. I've overlooked him. Guys, guys, I've guys. I've trained like a demon for 10 weeks for this man and I've sparred everybody. Been sparring Tyson. Been sparring a whole lot of them. Tyson. This Fury. man, this man, yeah, I promise you, you don't know what's coming for you. Did he take it easy on you? I can't wait because guess what? All the talking, it's done. Uh huh. 48 hours and you're over. Guys, you, know, you, know, you know what I want, you know what I want from both of you over, guys? Buddy. Guys, Tommy, KSI, what I want is a face-off, but after what happened last time, I want the face-off in the cage. Can you guys get in the cage and do a face-off in the cage? Can we do this? I'll happily Can do. we do a face-off in the That's cage, KSI, enough. Tommy Fury? Yeah.
the fuck out. You're going to get knocked out, buddy. You get knocked the fuck out, mate. Knock the fuck out. Come on. 48 hours. 48 hours, big man. 48 fucking hours. 48 hours. 48 hours. It's over for you. It's over for you. 48 hours, my friend. 48 hours. 48 hours, mate. And you're over. You're going to join Jake Paul as a beaten fighter. As a beaten man. 48 hours. 48 fucking hours. Legacy. You won't be able to do against me what you've done before. You're getting knocked spark out, boy. You're a bull. And you're getting sparked. You're getting sparked in my own town. Manchester. My fucking town. You're you're over. It's over for you. It's over. You're a bum. You're a bum. You're a bum. You're gonna cry. You're gonna get all that money. Green light. Green light. Green light. Green light. Green light. I'm very ready. 106 rounds. I've trained. 106 what? rounds. 210. I've died. I've died. I've died. Because the difference is, I'm a fighter yeah. and you are not. Yeah. You're a traditional You're a YouTuber. fighter. Go and play some more FIFA. Fighter. Go and play some more your FIFA. I'm the fucking fighter, not stone. you. Not you. You've been 48 hours and your time's up. 48 hours. I'm gonna do two days. Two There's days and your time's up. That's two days. Two days. Fear. Two days. There's nothing that's You're looking in the eyes of fighting, man. You're looking in. Don't walk away. Keep your eyes on me. Keep your eyes on me. You're looking in the fucking eyes of fighter. You're looking in the fucking eyes of it. You're fucking looking at it. You're looking at eyes of a fighter. To my friend, and you're getting fucked up. You understand? Fucked up. I'm gonna do to you what I should have done to you. Do you remember Jake Paul? I'm gonna knock you the fuck out. I promise you that. I promise you that. I'm gonna knock you the fuck out. It's over for you. I ain't no YouTuber. I'm not a rapper. I'm a fucking fighter. You need to fucking look in the eyes of one. You fucking bum. You bum. Stick to selling energy drinks. You fucking piece of shit. You fucking prick. Look at you. You're in my house now. You're in my house now. Manchester, my town. This is my homecoming, and you're getting it fucking slaughtered. Slaughtered. Not on my level. Not on my level. You fucking small middleweight. Uh -huh. Wait till the rip. Hey, hey Mrs. Mino, wait till fight night. Wait till fight night. Wait till fight night. You wanted the rehydration clause, didn't you? You didn't get it. My you didn't get it. I'm be fucking heavyweight in every game. Good. I'm gonna eat you for some serious shots. Nice and slow. Oh, big bull. Big bull. Just what I need. Nice and slow. Look at that fucking shape on it. Uh huh. Please. I'm middleweight. This is what you need. Bambi's bigger than you. Bambi's bigger than you. This is boxing, You're a middleweight. You're a middleweight. You're looking at a big man here who's going to take your head off. Uh -huh. I'm a big man who can fight. Get John in the cage! Get John in the cage! Get John in the cage!
is the bad boy. He is the Brazilian jiu-jitsu black belt. He is the undefeated MMA fighter. He is the one and only Dylan Dennis. I'm happy to see you. It's great to be here. You changed your shirt. I did, yes. <laughs> this is another one. Um, hey, a lot of these people sitting in this crowd, a lot of the people watching at home said, you wouldn't be here. Yeah. We're two days away. What do you say to those people who said you weren't showing up, that you had no intention of ever showing up? Fuck you. I don't know. I mean, <laughs> I was going to show up from day one. KSI was a nobody. That fight meant nothing. Um, this has a backstory, has a storyline. There's a lot behind it. That's the reason it's so big. Me and the Paul have been going back since 2018, 2019. Jake, Logan, all of them. So this storyline sells. And this is a lot more exciting than me and KSI. A lot of people are now saying that you're actually selling this card more than anyone. Yeah, Logan doesn't do shit. Guys. Like, you know, he doesn't, he doesn't know how to promote. I thought I gave him too much credit. I thought he was going to know how to promote. But he's not a real fighter, you know. He's a Karen, so he's a sewer. Have you taken it too far at any point? No. Fuck that bitch. And is she here? And no, you're referring to Logan Paul, I believe. You're, you're and, uh, the, the, the onslaught on Twitter mm. has... I'm trying to save him, man. Things. I'm just putting everything out there that's public. So I'm trying to bro-code him because he's going to get a divorce in about a year. But so, it has made things very personal between you two. Then tell him to do something about is, it. Is that part of the plan of attack here? Were you trying to make him emotional so that he wouldn't fight smart on Saturday? He's not, he's not a smart fighter either way. He doesn't know how to fight. So I'm going to show him what real fighting is. Uh, you've competed in a lot of big jiu-jitsu tournaments, Bellator as well. Four-time world champion. But where would you compare the tests that Logan Paul brings to the table on Saturday to what you've done in the past? In boxing, obviously, is my first test, so it's different, but I competed against some of the best ever in jiu-jitsu. And obviously, my MMA guys I have fought have not been top level, but in jiu-jitsu, I fought the best of the world four times in the same night. So this is easy money. I mean, Logan is a broken man already. I saw him yesterday. His demeanor changed. He doesn't have the cocaine and all the vodka that he was doing when we were doing the face-off. Um, it's going to be easy. He looked like he was scared yesterday or something. It was weird to see him like that. You know, he looked like weathered. I don't know. All right. Well, let's talk to Logan Paul now. He is one of the most uh, beloved and, he's coming out. dare I say, polarizing figures on the internet. Yes, he is coming out in a moment. Of course, he's been in this space for a very long time. Uh, dare I say, he has been a trailblazer of this crossover boxing scene dating back to his feud with KSI, who now, of course, is a very good friend of his. He is a WWE superstar. Now he's coming back to the squirt circle to fight this man. He is the Maverick. He is Logan Paul. Thank you, man. So many people out here. How y'all feeling? Okay. Let's go, baby. And so let me ask you a question that I sort of just asked him at the top. Dylan, are you surprised that he is here? Two days before the event, <laughs> was there a point in time that you thought surprised. this wasn't happening? Congratulations, Dylan. I got a fight. Yeah, you showed up to a fight, bro. Good for you, buddy. Oh, my mic. No, no. Good for you, oh, man. No, it's working. No, it's working. I hear you. Huh? I like I like seeing you in person, Dylan, because you're a little I like seeing puddle. you, too. Yeah, you melt in front of people, huh? Why'd you copy my haircut? With sunglasses inside, afraid to show your face. I'll show my face. Don't worry. Let's see it. I'm going to break your face on yeah, let's see, bro. I want to see you see, try. We're see. Don't I want to see you try. You're such a big man. I can't wait. Coming Don't here worry. looking like a shag carpet from 1980. You fucking idiot. <laughs> uh, he said that he saw you yesterday, that you look scared, that you look nervous. Look at what him now. What make of his assessment of um, your demeanor? I'm, I'm terrified. Dylan Dan is weight. potentially one of the, the biggest and, and best athletes of our generation. And so, uh, I, yeah, I'm horrified of him. How could you not be look at him? Okay, so speaking of that, you have been in the ring with with Floyd Mayweather, you fought KSI twice. Where would you rank Lost what KSI he brings twice. to the table as opposed to what you've dealt with? We, we haven't Mayweather. seen Dylan throw a punch. As far as we know, he's not even a real fighter. He's, he's claiming he is, but um, you can't prove that. You haven't fought in 1,600 days. And What's the last time you fought? show everyone What's the last time you just fought? how much you suck. What's the last time you fought? I do WWE, brother. I'm fighting every month. <laughs> I'm a superstar, unlike you. Fake you're fighting. Like you lose a your fake You fights. pretended to be a you superstar. You came and win a fake fight. And again, you still you won't take your glasses. Because you want to show your face because you're a little puddle. I'm not good. Fuck you. What do you make One of more his time. Outfit? One more time. <laughs> what do you make Get of his this outfit? This man, today, a glass Logan? of water, bro. What do you make of his outfit? I think he looks ridiculous. I think you need a stylist, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> and so here we are. Nothing. And so here we are, Logan. Is this the beginning of the new chapter in your boxing career, or is this just you want to shut this man up for the years of torment online, and then you're going back to pro wrestling? What's I think uh, I think I get the privilege of beating the shit out of Dylan Dennis. Someone gets to do it. I get and to be Subin. the one to do it. 
Because you're a coward. He needs to be shut up. You're a coward. I get to do it. He's the coward, in fact. Yeah, go see He's him. resorted to attacking an innocent bystanding Whore. woman for this entire Whore. fight buildup. Dylan Dennis is a stalker. You got over 600 photos of my fiance on your phone. That's, that's 600. <laughs> Just Google that's, it, buddy. Yeah, Google those. No, on your phone, your personal phone, you have an entire gallery of a woman you've never met before. That's that's weird, right? That's not normal behavior. You're a stalker. You're a cyber bully. In fact, Dylan, you're even a predator. You're a predator. And this uh, Saturday, October 14th, I'm going to catch you. And in fact, I brought an expert because we are going to catch you. I got my oh, boy, Chris Hansen. Chris Hansen. Oh. <laughs> Uh, because this Saturday, October 14th, <laughs> me and Chris Hansen are going to catch a predator. Wow. Uh, that is Chris Hansen. Yo, That's he, actually and him. And he's shooting a new show called Take Down. Tax evasion. He's shooting a new show called Take Down right now, and you're on it right now, buddy. He's in jail for Dylan tax evasion. Dennis. That name sounds very familiar. So he's telling me to sit down. I'm going to need you to take a seat right. right over there. Go ahead, take a seat. Stop him. <laughs> Go take pay your taxes, going, buddy. I, Go pay your taxes, I have buddy. I no issue there, brother. Oh, yeah, you do. No, I don't. You're wrong again. See, this is why I've been through the transcripts. This is actually Chris Hansen? This, this is, is Chris the real Chris Hansen. <laughs> <laughs> yes. So you need to okay, take Logan, a seat Okay, Logan, that's a good one. I'll give you that. Because I've been going through the transcripts, and I've seen some predatory behavior. They have resort to this. You don't make money anymore? I'm doing just fine, son. i got a whole new network. Logan Ball. True Blue came here on my own. True Blue, that's a new network. Takedown with Chris Hansen. That's the show. Well, his dad's a pedophile. So you should go out and, uh, You're just making shit up. You're lying. What do you mean? That's You're on a predator show right now, buddy. No, no, no. Literally, you have a YouTube video of him kissing a 16-year-old. You don't remember that? A what? A what year old? 16-year-old. You're just making shit up, though. I have it all. You're, li I'll you're, put li the you're video lying about on my everything. Twitter later, buddy. Bro, you're a predator. We're gonna catch you Saturday, October 14th. Fucking get Chris Hansen out here. Go pay your taxes. Yeah, buddy. right. <laughs> yeah, old man. Uh, that is another surprise. You brought one out back in August. And I thought that was surprised. an actor. No, this is the no, real Chris Hansen. No, no give Chris Hansen. That's some good ideas. Well done. Yeah, we're going to catch you, Dylan. It like Dumb and Dumber with that haircut. How does the fight end on Saturday night? However I want, uh, I will say, I, 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 I don't see it going past two rounds. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Make me. Oh, what a comeback. Oh, shut up. <laughs> what the fuck? Yo, fuck you. Okay. Uh, Who's that? I don't know that who Jay that Paul? is. It's very dark. <laughs> I, don't know I can't see you. Know you. That was? Uh, yeah, I think it was my father. Okay. Oh, um, you're a pedophile. Uh, you're making shit up. Let me ask Dylan. I'm not 16. I'm not in Dylan, a demographic, let me ask buddy. You, I'll give you the opportunity to ask, answer the same question. How, how, how do you beat him on Saturday? What's your official prediction? I think he quits on the stool. His corner throws in the towel. Um, he's a weak man. I'm going to break him. I'm going to break him. Can't wait for it now. My guy Ade is in the crowd right now. There are some uh, people who want to ask you guys questions as well. I, I, I'd like to ask okay. one question. I'm sorry, if, if you don't mind. Go ahead, go um, ahead, Logan. You, you obviously have no respect for women. Yeah. Um, is that okay. why you're not acknowledging your daughter? I don't have a daughter. We, we know about your daughter, Dylan, and you're doing it right now. You're yeah, not acknowledging her. This whole thing where he fakes I have a daughter. Are you, are you lying about that? Are you gonna bring her out? You, so you do have a daughter. <laughs> Show me. There's thousands of girls are saying I have their. No, why, why don't you acknowledge Josephine and your and her mom? Who? Your daughter Josephine, stupid. I, nah, nah, nah. You're even doing it right now. You got no respect for I have women. A son, buddy. You abandon your baby I have a son, mama. Bundy. You abandon your own daughter. You're willing to show your You're son. You're about to have a baby with daughter. a whore, so shut the fuck up. Yeah, he angry, huh? No, I'm angry. I don't care. Then why don't you acknowledge her? I have no idea what the fuck you're talking about. Shut up. Yeah, you do. <laughs> okay, stupid. Okay, the name's Josephine. And she's your come. daughter. You just copied some questions. Exactly we have some questions here. Take it away. Take it away. He said the same shit. We already proved it was wrong. No, we didn't, bro. Acknowledge your daughter. My kid, Acknowledge buddy. your daughter. Thousands you don't have any respect for women. You don't even know she exists. You're my son, bitch. And you abandoned her. You like Marcelo that. abandoned you. Savannah abandoned you. Oh, Conor McGregor even abandoned you. Where's he? Saturday, Mr. he'll be Mr. there. Don't Connor's worry. Saturday, he'll fight. be there. Don't worry. Where's he? Do you even have a coach? No. Because I don't Why need do a coach. You suck. Ariel, step in, Ariel. Ariel, step in. Step in, Ariel. There is a lot that is being said here. And a reminder, guys, you'll be going in that cage in a moment so you can say more to each other. For now, though, Ade, take it away. I was going to ask, I'll how much right. testosterone are you injecting in your ass each week oh, for, oh, oh. in the lead-up for this fight? It. We've heard it. <laughs> yeah. Any better questions? How tall are you, Bryce? You said you're big. I want to know. I'm 5'10", but my... Nah, 5'10", you rounded I'm up. Fi I'm 5'10", but my arms are like almost the same size as yours. And, and, and you do it steroids? No. You guys I'm not on steroids. steroids. <laughs> but, but I was asking you because like... <laughs> I you have, you have a decent physique. Uh, oh, I'm okay. asking you how much testosterone are you injecting? Did you say we have the same physique? I said you have a decent physique. You have a decent... Oh, I, appreciate, I appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah, no steroids here. I'm no steroids here. No steroids here. So what's the Keemstar? Keemstar. Okay. Keemstar, no steroids.
Sorry, Sarah, question, no, please, Kingston. Is that the yeah. same dealer or not? How you doing, brother? Did, did you question to who? Price Hall. Uh, Price Hall the question is to Dylan Dennis. Dylan Dennis, after you beat Logan Houston. Paul, will you fight Chris Hansen? Oh, that's easy money. Bring him out here right now. Bring that old man out here. <laughs> Maybe he could pay his taxes after. Yo, that's crazy. You you can me and Chris Hansen too. about to catch you, you Saturday, bro. <laughs> Right. Uh, more questions? We have more questions. Mr. IFL TV is in the building. Coogan Cassius. Coogan Cassius? Stand up, Coogan. Question to who, Cooks? Uh, question to uh, Logan Paul. Logan, do you, regardless of the outcome on Saturday, do you think you'll shake Dylan's hand after the fight? Never. Because it's personal for him. It's business for me. So whatever happens, you are. It is business. He doesn't care about this fight. He doesn't care if he wins or loses. He's doing anything he wants watch, to win this buddy. fight. Nah, you, bro, you me easy. We watch, haven't seen you throw watch, a punch. Watch. Watch. As we saw you do jujitsu. Why'd you do jujitsu? Because you wanted to copy me. I got to be ready for anything, buddy. Who knows what a guy like this Why is going to do? Why would you fight me in Look MMA then if you could do I did not see that coming, looking like a cheetah. <laughs> what, this? Yeah, you stupid ass. I'll loan it to you. You can go get it. One more time. Where do we Any more stand? questions, Cooks? On the MMA uh, he uh, range. He said if I show up, is there he fight me in MMA, he shook my hand like a man. And you told He's me not a that man, if though. I win, you're going to give me your we whole purse. We didn't shake hands on that. So when you give hands. me your whole purse, when I beat you, yeah, then I'll rematch you All in right. MMA. But still, you shook my hand on the MMA thing. We didn't fine, shake hands fine, on the other fine. thing. And you said you give me your whole purse. We didn't shake hands. You give me your whole we purse, didn't shake hands. we can do MMA. Why are you scared to do MMA? That's you a verbal agreement. You know jujitsu. That's a verbal agreement. Ariel, Ariel, Ariel. I'm still working through it. I've been through this. When I did the face off, I, I said like five words. I was trying to. I know get what you're going through right now, Ariel. On I know what you're right. going through. Right, Logan go Paul ahead. and Dylan Dennis are going to go off the stage because when we come back, KSI and Tommy Fury are going to go up there. Thank you so much for watching this video and make sure to subscribe for more videos of your favorite fighters over here on Fight Up TV and give us a follow online as well at Fight Up TV on Twitter and on Instagram. We appreciate it guys.